look at him, he's in shape, he's ready. No, I'm telling you, look at that. Look, be careful. Because come this weekend, you're going to see something nuts. And I'm being serious. I've witnessed it. I spar him all the time, bro. I'm telling you. When Marvin Hagler says that, you already know what it is, man. <laughs> you already know what it is. You've got to tune in. Boxing in two days. Hit me. Boom, boom, boom. Whoa. That's how we roll. <laughs> so, I'm just walking back from the bank. Walked over to pick up a bit of cash. I could buy this car. Cash. Right now. So a couple of days before the fight, I take a stroll to the bank, take out some cash so that I can pay back the money for all the tickets I ordered to sell from the promoter. Now this is one of the sides of boxing that obviously people know about in terms of fighters having to sell tickets or what have you. But or this video is just to give you a bit of an insight into some of the things that we have to do like walk into the bank to take out cash tallying everything up, making sure everything's all in place and that's actually got to be done before fight night so to all those people who like to wait till the day before the fight or the day after the fight to call and go have you got any tickets left mother f I'm fighting yeah I'm going into battle one of the last things I want to think about is whether or not you've got your ticket or not and if it's a really good seat if you want one grab one before fight week but anyway See the sun. Whoa. That's how we roll. We are going to the public workout at the Peacock Gym. My chauffeur's just picked me up. And that's S class. As you do. Are we ready to roll, baby? Stay tuned. Woo! I felt Bring bad because I was Bring just blacked out. out on this sunny day. But I guess it's what real G's yes, do. Yeah, it's blacked out. We've got him. This is good. Yeah. Just arriving <laughs> for the public workout. Andrew's left the window open. Gonna make my way in. Ooh. It's gonna be busy. Is this for your vlog? I don't mind going on there. No beef this time. Coogan's coming on my channel. <laughs> People trying to get on his channel, but he's coming on mine. Do you know what I mean? It's about to happen right now. I'm about to meet you guys. Top boxers by his side. Oh, I don't know. Going to sleep. I only come see him though. My man Mo, undefeated. 30 fights deep, undefeated. Hardest hitting band and weight in the world. There's no one can compete with this man. Mo just walked in here like he belongs in there. This whole shit was set up for Mo. <laughs> My boy OD doing his thing. Talking the most shit. So. That's his opponent right there, and his opponent's trainer. He's in the ring giving it to him. When he was in his public workout, so he's still giving it to him then. Listen. Two tags! Two tags! Bring him out, bring him out. Hey! Bring him out, bring him out. Kill! Bring him out, bring him out. Wait, wait, hold on. How long you got? No, you got more than that. We're, we're gonna do a whole minute segment with OD where we talk about what fighters do fight week and getting ready for the fight. Okay, cool. Yeah? Obviously, just give people a bit of an insight to what fighters do fight week. Fight week, I like to have two days clear without training before I fight. I don't train um, on the Sunday and then from the Monday, I train every day after the fight. What, even a Friday? No, no, apart from the Friday. Oh, right, okay. Playing. After the Friday, I spend the whole time eating as many burgers. No, not, no, not burgers. Oh, wait. Eating as many milk burgers, <laughs> as many Vinnie's meals, as much, as much healthy food as I can. Yeah. And then on the Sunday morning, burgers, chips, fries. Let's chill here for a bit. What should we start again? No, no, that's cool. Just sit down and carry on. It's all natural, it's all Gucci. Yeah. So yeah, I'll do it different to OD. So he doesn't train on a Sunday, then he does Monday to Friday. Monday to Friday. That's mad. I like. I think that's mad because I like to have the two days off before what, the fight. Two days night. before the weigh-in. No, nah, before the fight. So, so, so I mean, you so, gotta make weight by the first day. Then. Yeah, I'm always on weight though. Yeah, you come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you know. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like at the moment, I'm like a pound overweight. Suns sure. out, guns out. <laughs> this time I get to weigh in on. Um, it's Friday as well, so I'm looking forward to eating properly leading up yeah. to fight now. Because actually, I've been waiting on the same day. Really? Yeah, yeah. I've done that once as well. Yeah, shit. So, the way I do it as well, so I train the Sunday normal. 
Then on um, Monday I'll do three minute rounds. Tuesday I'll do two minute rounds. On Wednesday I'll do one minute rounds. But I don't like to take it a bit too light because I think it'll take me out of my game. As I'm in camp and I'm and I train Monday until the Friday. Even on the Friday I feel fresh. And yeah. I spar hard on a Monday. I spar hard on a Wednesday, and on a Friday I still I will still be fresh. Yeah. So I'm like, when it comes to fight night, I don't want to change it up a bit too much. Yeah, I still yeah. Keep it, I still want to. Because you got that recovery. Have that yeah. It's lighter, a bit lighter, but it's still not light. Yeah, yeah. And then I feel like rest on the Friday. You just can't afford to go 100 percent on fight week because yeah, obviously exactly, then. Yeah. You, as much as you obviously by what you're saying you've got that like, very good recovery and whatnot but there's only so much recovery you can do in a week i do the same but like i said it's short bursts so everything's sharp 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 so that's just a little bit of insight two different fighters two different methods to fight we prep even as a day williams a fight i really want to see i, oh. I see them go back you and beat me to it <laughs> that'd be a great fight and the kind of styles that they have it will make an exciting exciting fight all these been training with me from when i started this team from my first fight with one tournament together, do you know what I mean? So if he's saying it's going to be a good fight and he knows that was all, then you better believe it. Shout out Carlos, opening two gyms. I'm the biggest one, so you have a shout out. Put it out here, man. My reach is what? 250k views a week. So. Listen, yeah, out of 200, out of all. Oh, that's <laughs> the score. <laughs> 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 Instagram. Oh, oh, I'm about to rip up the industry. And listen, I swear. Out of 250k <laughs> followers, all I need is one pound from everyone. One pound, put it in the long envelope. It's not to me, like, I swear. Dude, that's why I'm just giving people. However, you want it, I'm one pound. I've got to mix one, two, see I can't even see. Hey, why don't we just split 50 I'm promising. Trust me, if you invest in me, I'm afraid I'll start pressing a little. <laughs> I got this. Woo! So we're going to get a haircut, guys. Gonna go get a nice trim. Go back, chill at the hotel. And Andy's candy allowed me to drive his sick whip. The roles are reversed. Now I'm the one doing the chauffeuring. But you know why? It's because you gotta get it nice and quick. Kids drive safe. And don't use your phones. Let somebody else do it for you. I'm not going to sit here and pretend to be a guy who watches match of the day and that, I don't. Do you know who was on job actually? Iran. I didn't know they were good. No, they lost, but they played good, man. Yo, what? They played good. Yeah. That's cool, but it doesn't take away from the fact that I came. With all that running, all that there, all this bit. What, Fanny Joshua? Is that shit with the tag as well? Yeah, yeah. There with his mum. Oh, that's you, yeah? Yeah. On the bricky as well. That's good, how much you get paid for that? Alright, maybe some money. Yeah. So, you was his body double, okay? I was playing a 19 year old version of him. So, you know I'm getting double paid today, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking, that's what he's gonna get the beers in, bro. Like, came on the I just got a haircut. And damn, I look good. In the words of Bruno Mars, I want to kiss myself and so pretty. <laughs> That's a bit of a touch though, ain't it, the advert coming on? <laughs> you got to get to see a little bit of how I react to when I'm on. So actually, usually I don't say anything, but um, it's kind of relevant, isn't it? We're still already talking about boxing and whatnot, so here's what it is. But now I'm looking forward to going to the hotel, chilling out a bit, and then waiting in tomorrow. And getting, getting to eat as much as I want. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Guys, I've just checked in. Have a look. To what's gonna be home for the next few days. Got a nice lovely suite. And baby, I can look at the venue. I'm gonna be boxing there. Focus, get me in that. Yeah, buddy. I'm here, O2, I'm about to show up. Come on, guys, you know you gotta turn up or tune in one way or the other. Just don't miss the show, man, I'm gassed. Yo! Popcorn is life, baby. And I got more. <laughs> hey, listen. Like I said before on one of my snaps, any dietitian who tries to take popcorn out of my diet, I will sack him. And Andrew, I need a popcorn as a sponsor, please. I spend way too much money on this thing. I'm quite passionate about it, so I'll be a very sound ambassador for a brand. I'm going to have some more today again before the weigh-in, probably. <laughs> right now, I'm going to tuck into my breakfast, guys. Plant-based food. So... Avocados, bananas, I never take those things out of my diet. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Well, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and 
welcome to the official weigh-in as we get set for championship boxing tomorrow at the O2 here in London. Undefeated with 16 wins, 6 by knockout, here is Daryl. <laughs> He's undefeated with two wins. Here is Umar, top boxer, Sadiq. Boys, you might be on the vlog. Gang it. If it makes a cut. <laughs> Wayne's done. I'm gonna go get something to eat now. But, peace out. Peace out! <laughs>